mic was muted. Good morning. I was testing out my sound commands. Yeah, yeah. Nice way to end the music with a big old boom, right? <clears throat> and you can tell from my nasally voice that I'm still recovering from being sick. So, anyway, welcome, welcome. I probably could have streamed yesterday, but I was too fucking lazy. <clears throat> I'm also in the middle of a, uh, I'm in the middle of a baseball draft. This league I've been in for four or five years. It's with a bunch of other uh, fancy baseball experts that I used to work with. So, if you hear these weird ass chimes going off in the background, that means somebody made their pick because I have the draft live in the background. So, <clears throat> I should pick at some point again today. But anyway, uh, not feeling great, but. I got to get this fucking season over with, so let's go. <clears throat> Let me turn the sounds back on for the game because I always turn them off. So you're going to hear me clear my throat quite a bit and coughing and hacking and carrying on, so just, just deal with it. It's, it's, it is what it is. My wife gave me this cold. All right, let's go check our recruiting real quick because... Uh, so far, we've gotten a halfback, a tackle, a guard, a center, a corner, a free, and a strong. Those are what we've already committed. <clears throat> so, we'll go look at this. There's our center. There's our tackle. There's our guard. There's our strong. D-end, halfback, free, corner. So. And we still need a quarterback, still chasing Philip Morris, the number one quarterback in the game. Jeff Brown's going to play running back. Uh, these two wide receivers. We need another guard. We need a D tackle. We need two outsides. And we need a corner. But I'll take both because we'll replace that 68 with a 78 if we get them. And the rest of these guys are just extra. So, <clears throat> and uh, this middle linebacker and this D end are both JUCOs. So, <clears throat> that's where we stand with all of that. <clears throat> um, we are in the top 25. We are number 18, even though we lost. We are still number one in our half of the conference. <clears throat> Yeah, we lost that game by 10 to Auburn, but bounced back, so still can't stop the run, but that's that's the sliders we're playing on, so we have Vatac, Virginia, and NC State today, um, maybe tomorrow we'll finish these three up, yeah, that little chime you heard, that's, that's the draft, oh, this motherfucker took the player I wanted, oh, I hate playing in leagues with people who know what they're doing. <laughs> <clears throat> Fuck. Stop messing with my draft. <clears throat> All right. Without further ado, let's get in and start playing because I don't want to be playing all fucking day long. Oh, yeah. And I have two controllers going because I like my PS5 controller better than the uh, PS3. So, all right. Let's fix their shoes because those are ugly. We're going orange, huh? Well, if we're going orange, let's go orange. I can give you a white helmet. What's up, Nathan? How you doing, man? Welcome in. And uh, we're going to go with this. And, uh, yeah, let's go. So, Rocky, my daughter, did not get into Mizzou Vet School this year. She applied, had her interview, and she found out today she didn't get in. So, she's upset, of course, because that's been her lifelong dream since she was a little girl. And so, she didn't play college volleyball because she wanted to go to Mizzou, so she had a better shot to get into her vet school, and then she didn't get in. So, so it sucks on two levels because she could have had 
good chunk of her college paid for under scholarship. So, no, she she only wanted to go to Mizzou. So now she'll have to look at other schools, um, and she needs to talk to the people that work at the vet school that she works for. The one lady said she would hire her to help her with her research projects and shit, but she needs to figure out what she needs to do to get in. They had three times the normal number of people apply for vet school, and they only take like 23%. So even in a normal year, her chances were 23%, and then you triple that. So, So anyway... And she has to keep going to school half time at least, or she'll have to start paying our loans back. And she owes like sixty grand. <clears throat> <clears throat> so at least sixty grand. Anyway. Anyway. So, I'll see her in a couple of weeks when she comes in town for spring break because she's getting her uh, wisdom teeth taken out. All four. So she's going to be a mess. She's going to be on Percocet for a week. <laughs> I had my, I had all four of my wisdom teeth taken out like 10 days after I had right shoulder surgery. So that was fun. So I was taking a lot of pain meds for both. And I had to brush my teeth left-handed. And so you hit one of those freshly dug out pockets of your gums with a toothbrush oh my god i wanted to jump through the roof <laughs> no her 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 grades were fine so i think she's lacking um some math classes so she may have to take those as the uh, other classes to go part-time so she's a good student she's not a bad student at all she was on she was on a dean's list for last semester <clears throat> So, we'll figure it out. We will figure it out. Oh, all right, let's get all this shit taken care of. <clears throat> oh, man. What the hell? This, this, I don't know. I think it's the wire to this controller. This PS5 controller. It, uh. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Oh, don't make me restart. Please don't. There we go. All right, here we go. Oh, this fucking thing. It's not disconnected. It's plugged in. Look, it's plugged in. Come on. Find it. Let's go. Find it. All right. I'm going to stay as still as I possibly can and see what happens. Whatever reason, it didn't charge. I left my PS5 on uh, sleep mode last night, so it would charge this controller. And for whatever reason, it didn't. So I don't know why, but it didn't. So. <clears throat> yeah, I, I got my uh, degree and I don't even use it. So... This is going to be the theme of the entire stream. Me struggling to play run defense with this team because they just don't like to tackle. They they literally do not like to play. Hold on a sec. 
I think I have my mixer. <sighs> yeah, I have the volume of the capture card down. All right, this should be better. Yeah, now you can hear it better. I have to turn it down when I'm not streaming because it it blares through my speakers so much that I, I turn it down so I can watch, so I can play the game and watch YouTube videos. So <clears throat> I have to tone it down so it doesn't bleed through. Oh, let's do this. <laughs> Coach Stradamus, you gotta love it. On uh, Heisman, the CPU has it, so I, I have no problem using it against them. <clears throat> I apologize for my sniffing and snorting, but it's just a. Uh, it's just gonna be a thing, guys. Sorry. Look at this dude. Third and 12, and they just run a 26 yard draw. What do I have these set on? All right, we're on the 1090. We're just going to live with it. <clears throat> And Rocky, I have the uh, halfback ability at, uh, why did it switch cameras? Why, why did it switch cameras on me? Oh my God, nobody can fucking tackle. All I did was look at my sliders and it changed my uh, view. I don't, I, don't, I don't understand what happens with this game. I just don't get it. <sighs> so I was telling Rocky off camera that I'm... Uh, I'm playing a, uh, a new dynasty for my own sake. I'm at New Mexico. They're 65 overall with a 61 offense. And uh, look at that. Flipped his ass. And uh, I'm limiting my uh, recruiting just a, a tad so I don't go out and low lock cheese and get a great team right away. Because um, my coaches. Coaches shouldn't be going 13 and 0 their first year, you know that kind of thing. Yeah, of course. So uh, it's been interesting trying to find a slider set where I don't just get steamrolled, but I don't just run amok with a with a 61 offense. It's not easy, actually. But that's about the only thing I'm looking forward to with the new game, is kind of seeing if there's any uh, real uh, difficulty help. <clears throat> yeah, hold your block just a little bit longer, guys. Just a little bit longer. <laughs> All right, with these, with these uh, sliders, we have to warm up. We have to warm up our running back and our quarterback. So this first drive is always a very patient pain in the ass. <clears throat> yeah, Nathan. So I can I can recruit anybody that has New Mexico in their top ten. Um, and then. 
I can recruit anybody in the pipeline states, but they have to be my star level. So I'm looking at one star players. Let me tell you, there's a lot of shit to go through. And there's very few players worth even considering. All right, looks like there's been two picks in my draft. Several picks, actually. All right, four more guys go, and then it's my turn. Oh, I have to decide if I want to get an outfielder or a catcher right now. It's fourth round. I shouldn't be going for a catcher. But I really don't want to take Giancarlo Stanton in the fourth round either. So Now, we, we have keepers in this league. We have keepers. So I, as my keepers, I already had Pete Alonzo, Rafael Devers, Anthony Santander, Framber Valdez, and Ryan Presley. So fourth round is really the ninth round. So, and I uh, I drafted uh, Trey Turner in the first round, and then I just took Brandon Woodruff and Sean Bieber with my last two picks. I need outfield badly. Somebody I'm looking at in like the twelfth round is uh, is Bryce Harper because I know he's going to miss half the year, but when he comes back. We uh, we get rid got rid of the uh, IR in our league and we just added ten more bench spots. How is he playing the ball? That ball's going to the tight end that's ten yards behind him. Look at this play. I'm throwing this to the inside guy. I'm throwing it to this guy right here. No, I'm sorry. I'm throwing it to this guy. He's gone this deep out. And he's guarding this underneath guy. And I throw it over his head, and somehow the angle's too low, and he just Superman jumps to knock that pass down. Mm -hmm. Shenanigans. Rebuild for the MLB. Um, depends on if you want to really tear everything down. Or... Uh, just just enhance what's there. I mean, Miami's got a big, huge stadium. and But the problem with MLB Rocky is they all have uh, spending limits, right? So some teams spend $200 million and some teams only spend $90 million. So you're really limited because they uh, you can't go out and spend a bunch of money, not only on free agents, but to keep your own guys. So... The trick is to find a, a team that has money, but a shit roster. <laughs> like the Angels. If you could get rid of some guys off that team. But you'd be better off to trade away Trout and Otani and, and restock that team. <clears throat> uh, tried to juke, but it's a little too early in the game for him to be juking. He hasn't carried the ball enough. So, let's help him out. Where's my... There it is. God, just no burst yet. He's got to get five carries before he runs for the shit, so... Hang on. Thank you. Thank you. I was looking at him the entire way. I normally throw it to the right, but on that play, I was looking strictly to throw the ball on the backside slant. <clears throat> One of the NWO games recently, uh, revamps like, yeah, Vaughn likes to run those double slants. And I'm like, because usually the backside guy is wide open. And if he's not open, then the, the uh, front side slant guy is going to be crossing the 
the face of the middle linebacker, and he's going to have a nice run up the field. So you just look at those two guys, and whichever one's not covered, just throw it to him. Oh, my. Not going to be a ton of recruiting going on in the stream today, guys, because we we got a good chunk of our class and everybody. We're number one on almost everybody, so... We're just going to be uh, cranking out these games so we can try to get guys committed and uh, get through this season. Rocky, I'm going to tell you right now, if we somehow get in the natty this season, which is a very possible scenario, I'm out of here. We, we win a natty in year two, I'm gone. Absolutely gone. <laughs> Go somewhere else where I have more fun. <clears throat> Although we're bringing in some really good players, so I shouldn't uh, shit all over the team just yet. Oh, this fucking controller. Stop it. Go down, bitch. God. I need to get a new uh, a new cable for the uh, PS5 to charge this controller because for whatever reason this one is dog shit. <laughs> we audibled so they uh, false started so they could uh, change their play. The the CPU in this game cheats so bad. You call the right defense to shut them down, and they false start to get a new play called. Now they're going to dot me up. Watch. <clears throat> Look at this. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. That makes it first and ten. That's why I always stay with two man under because the CPU. That's why I recruit man coverage corners, and I just play two man under because the zones in this game are dog shit. Jeez. The linebacker can't cover the tight end. This middle linebacker gets beat off the line of scrimmage by a tight end. As I said when we started the stream, I am uh, I, I'm having so much trouble with this team stopping anything on the ground game. Doesn't matter what plays I call, doesn't matter what I use her, no one wants to tackle. And they don't shed any blocks. I know it's the sliders. If I, if I set these sliders to something a little more uh, normal than 1090, uh, we might have a little more luck, but then we wouldn't be challenged yourself, right Rocky? Heaven forbid we have fun in our own fucking stream without having to worry about is it challenging enough for some baby back bitch who uh, couldn't beat us if they wanted to. I think this guy's a pocket passer too. <laughs> hey, Big Perk, I have challenged him. But see, they play on PC and not PS3. So they can't play head to head with us. They don't even want to play the NWO because they're not that good. <clears throat> I would love to run my offense against Barrett. Just would love to run my offense against that little bitch. Yeah. 
Hey, at least we picked up four. This guy is not a burner. If I had somebody with 95 speed, I would have got all the way to the edge on that play. But now he has six carries, so he should be able to run like his ratings are, as opposed to stuck in the mud. As I said, he should be able to run. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Nathan, I have the show on pre-order, so we'll be doing some MLB The Show. Very likely, I'll do MLB stuff at night. <clears throat> Although I might do some during the day, but I, I uh, my uh, high school ref season kicks off on March 21st. So I have to leave at 3 o'clock and usually don't get back till like 7.30 or so. Which really uh, shuts down how much I can stream. Although I could probably stream some like Diamond Dynasty shit in the mornings but that'll uh, severely curtail my uh, NCAA streaming it happens every year so it's another reason why I want to get done with this dupe <clears throat> perk uh, MLB the show has not been the same since Donaldson was on the cover um the year they had Griffey on the cover, they changed the hitting dynamic in that game. And uh, now it sucks. It absolutely sucks. I'm tired of popping out on uh, good contact. So here's, here's how they changed the hitting. In the past, when you swung the bat, it was like a flat wall hitting the ball. And they changed it so that it was more a, a round cylinder, you know, just like a regular bat and so you can make good contact but pops it up instead of mashing it 400 feet so you can have really really good contact and just get a weak pop out and you can be really late on a pitch and smoke it 400 feet the opposite way there's there's really no rhyme or reason that makes it second and, eight. and they also have um i think the field's not quite big enough I think the field is a little too big, and uh, um, the outfielders get to everything. Nothing drops in the gap. Everything's run down and caught at the wall. You don't get any shots to the gap that get down and go to the wall. Um, and there's no like deep fly ball that just goes over the top of their head and to the wall. Um, they just chase everything down. So there's there's a lot in that game that needs to be fixed. And since Diamond Dynasty really took over um, in 16 and 17, they've they've really done the same thing that they did with Madden and the gameplay, the regular gameplay and the franchise stuff has taken a backseat to making money. These ultimate game, <clears throat> ultimate team games in every sport have fucked up the regular gameplay. All they see is dollar figures. <clears throat> I ran all the way around the defense and I hit him and I just slipped right off his back. No, I don't play Ultimate Team in Madden at all. I'll do Diamond Dynasty because I used to collect baseball cards, so it's kind of fun to collect the cards. But I don't, I don't play a lot of head-to-head -head in that game. Um, nice, finally get him short of the first down. I might play against Cincy Bowen. I told him I was getting the game, and if he wanted to play head-to-head, -head, he might kick my ass. But it'd be fun to play somebody I know. But, uh, yeah, I generally don't like playing online sports games. <clears throat> yeah, every Ultimate Team is a money racket. Every single one. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry about the snorting and the coughing, but I'm still not 100% from this cold that my wife gave me. Getting better. 
Uh, that play would have gone for a lot more if our offensive line could have held their block just a little bit longer. I don't know if I have any visits in this week. I probably do. So I need to get my passing game going here. Yeah, the first year that they really put out good content for Diamond Dynasty was 16. And it really got, it was something that they did, they really got their shit going good um, in the off season, in the winter, like January, February. And it made that winter go so fast and, and it was a lot of really, really good grinding. But now they give away too many 99s. They're giving fucking prospects who've never played in the majors 99 overall cards, and it's just, it ruins the game. Ruins the game. I don't mind grinding for a good card, but if you're just going to give 99s away like candy. Robinson going to go to the house again. There we go. That's why we love that play. Do it again because it was too quick. Oh, yeah! That'll help the passing yards. <clears throat> oh, this fucking controller. Stop. I'm going to go back to my uh, PS3 controller for the next game because I'm tired of this shit. It's a new controller and some of the buttons are still a little sticky. Here, so you guys can see what we're rolling with. Since we were told that we, uh, our 95 game win streak was, was not good because we were playing on too easy of a sliders, okay? <clears throat> I always have both teams at 35, and I will always have the CPU at 50, because if you put these guys anything above 50, they become bowling balls and they just run through everybody. <clears throat> even at 50, they still run through everybody. <coughs> but it's even worse at 90. Yeah, no one to pitch to. Why did he go the exact opposite way? What was that? Someone explain that play to me. Why did he do this? He's got the pitch man right here. He bounces off. Just pitch it. Look. If he pitches right there, he's got the entire sideline. That's probably to the house. But I hit him, and so he decides, no, we're going to go the other way, all the way across the field with no one to pitch to. <laughs> Hey, all right, I'll take it. <laughs> that was crazy. Jesus, somebody cover this tight end. That's twice that he's been wide open right down the middle of the field. I have him on man coverage and no one wants to cover this guy.
<laughs> this fucking punch to the face bullshit. Yeah, Nathan, I just got done refing a huge tournament in downtown St. Louis. It's the same tournament where that girl got hit by the, the car and lost her legs. I didn't ref her team, but I was refing at that tournament. And I know that exact intersection. I used to work downtown. And I used to walk by that intersection frequently when I would go have lunch. Um, and like halfway through the second day, I was just like, I don't want to do this anymore. I'm tired of the constant bitching and moaning by the coaches and the players and the fans. It's like, seriously, I'm trying to do my job here. And all you guys want to do is just bitch and bitch and bitch and bitch. About everything, not just big plays. Every fucking thing is a bitch fest. Oh, wow. He had tight coverage and he hit him anyway. Yeah, there's no way I would do basketball with people doing that shit. I see too many, uh, too many people getting attacked. <laughs> it's just fucking crazy. People have lost their minds. <clears throat> This Vatek team is uh, two and five. They're slightly better than us on their rate, the ratings. So. Get that block. Thank you. Thank you. Is he going to go to the house? Does he have enough steam to get there? Yes, he is. There we go. Yeah, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Well, in uh, they they do that in high school and in uh, volleyball and basketball. They have teams on both sides of the scorers table. What's up, Rosie? How you doing? <clears throat> it's only baseball and football that they're on opposite sides. The only problem is we gave them two minutes so they can march back down the field here. I knew once I got that one block, I had a long run coming. It was just a matter of if I had enough stamina to get all the way down the field. Because that dude is fast, but his acceleration is shit. So it was it was a matter of, am I going to run out of steam before somebody catches me from the, the left side? Yeah, it's kind of hard to police where they put the fans, though. Fucking go down! <sighs> this is the shit I'm talking about. It just runs right through them. No one tackles. No one can tackle. I hit them two or three times, and they just bounce off like they're a fucking bowling ball, man. <clears throat> oh, I can't. I want to get this game over so I can go back to my PS3 controller because it's, it's the wire. It's this wire. There's a problem with the wire. Yeah, I guess that just makes up for the kickoff return, right? <clears throat> Watch me run another one back. Nope. The guy did not block well enough. That's okay. Minute 50. What's our pass yards at? All right, 149. We gotta get that up. Let's try this again. See if they learned their lesson from last time. Looks <clears throat> like they're playing more of a man here. Uh, and then I tripped over a guy. Yeah, it's all right. Somebody else 
Dallas just made a pick. Yeah, three more guys go, and then it's my turn. If I'm not mistaken, we get the ball stuck to half. Is that right? I think we get the ball stuck to half. Could be wrong though. No, I don't want to see the replay. That'll make it second and seven. Alert, alert, steamer, steamer, alert, alert, steamer, steamer, alert, steamer, alert, alert, steamer, steamer. There's Q's player. I'm gonna call a timeout. So everybody's well rested. I don't burn too much time off. Curls on the outside. Let's go out of bounds, save a timeout. walk this in just like that this is uh, third or fourth of the half right check that out when we get to halftime Yeah, they have, they have uh, the yardage uh, difference in the game because we ran that kickback for a touchdown. Otherwise, we'd be much more even or we might be slightly ahead. Yeah, we definitely would be ahead if we hadn't uh, ran that kickback. So... Bounce off the guy. 13 seconds. Two timeouts. It's like three plays. Let's go with six DBs on the field. <clears throat> Watch this play. Ah, just couldn't get that safety in front to knock it down. All right, eight seconds. That's two plays. And the false start. It's their second one of the half. CPU will do that. Every time you get the right play called, they'll just false start and reset. Got him. That's a fumble, not an incomplete pass. All right. Well, let's not shit the bed here and give up a late score because we've done this before. I'll take the pick. <clears throat> there we go. All right. Fucking 35 point half. The 
we do get the ball. So I want to check my running back and see what he's done. Because I think he has four touchdowns in his half. QB has one throw. He's got three rushing and one receiving. So he's got four touchdowns in this game. And then we had the kickoff return. Just a little more agility, and I could have juked a little bit better. That's all right. I'll take eight yards. I'm not complaining about eight yards on first down. <clears throat> I mean, if they want to play off like that, hit them. Every time. There we go. 49er George. Hip hip Jorge. Six yard catch. He said, this dude is a pocket passer. He's not a uh, running quarterback. He's got 70-something speed, but he's big and strong, so. <clears throat> there we go. Wide open. Touchdown. Tight end. All right, we got our two-score lead, so now we need to play defense. Get the ball back. Don't give up any points. Get our QB over 300 yards passing, and then we'll just work on running the ball the rest of the game. Finally, somebody tackled that dude. If he'd gone over the middle, he probably have gone for 40. There we go. I was using the linebacker that was covering him, so all I was doing was watching him. As soon as he took off, that's why I went over there, and then my CPU guys did their job. <clears throat> I love it. All right, big stop here, guys. Big stop. Oh, and then he just releases him. You can't let him get behind you like that. He's got to stay. You got to stay in front behind him and keep him in front of you. You can't let him just run. I, I have the pass rush coming. They're going to get to the quarterback and just let him go up the middle of the field. <sighs> Fucking AI logic in this game. There you go, Bob. 
No 75 yard run this time, bitch. Oh, he fumbled. Pick it up. Yes. Yes. We got it. All right. That's what we needed. That's what we needed. Why is it not doing that? Did I forget what that command is? Yeah, that should work. Hmm. Jerry, I'm telling you, I have this power, and I have no control over it. There we go. Not sure why that didn't go the first time. I guess it was too close to the other one. Uh, now we're going to get screwed, because he was down. Yeah, he was. I love how the knee hits the ground and that causes the ball to pop out. <laughs> That's right, still third and two. Somebody fucking tackle. Somebody fucking cover. Everybody's wide open because we're just standing out there with a thumb up our ass. No one paying attention. Four guys there, but nobody could get there quick enough. That's all right. Third and eight. Somebody make a fucking play. Yeah, I saw that guy drop out of pass block and was like, I'm not rushing the quarterback. We're going to cover this dude. <clears throat> what did you do? What was he looking at? He just ran away from the defender, uh, the, the receiver. Just ran away from him. He didn't even look for the ball. This fucking controller. <sighs> Home Drive Gaming, hey, thanks for the follow, appreciate that, welcome in. I didn't think he was going to get a second of the day. <clears throat> He's fast, but he has no acceleration, so. Let's see what Coach wants to run. Four verts. Coach always wants to run four verts. We'll take that quick 13 yards.
All right, one more decent pass, and they'll get us over the 250. I forgot to look at who was visiting this week, so we got to make sure we get our yards. Right, we already got our 100 yards rushing, but we got to make sure we get our. Uh, well, I want 300 yards passing, not 250, but. Now that dude has 95 speed. <clears throat> he's just a, I think he's a freshman, so he doesn't get a lot of playing time. Mr. Robinson's having a great game today. Almost. A little more speed, and that's a touchdown. All right, let's finish this off with Mr. Robinson. Give him his fifth tutty of the day. We're running 3-3-5. And gains half a yard. And we're going to let this clock run out so that we take this into the fourth quarter just to burn more time off the clock. So <clears throat> I need to go get a drink. I'm out of coffee. We need to get some water. So as soon as this game's over, while it's updating the week, I'm going to run upstairs and get some water. I call it the play, but we're just gonna let, just gonna sit here. Oh, this fucking cord. Is this is a cord issue. As soon as this day is over and I'm done streaming, I'm gonna order a new fucking cord because this is terrible. All right, we just wanna take this to the fourth quarter. There we go. It's less time for Vatek to have the ball total. Look at this. They have two down linemen. They're playing the pass. Why would you play the pass when this dude has four rushing touchdowns now? <laughs> What's up, Eagles? Yeah, Nathan, I'll, I'll go there. I'll get it, like, tomorrow, too, because I have Prime. So I'm uh, – Eagles have been sick since late Friday afternoon. And uh, I was supposed to go see my daughter and – at Mizzou Saturday and didn't get to do that and been trying to uh, slowly recover here. I would have streamed yesterday, but I was too fucking lazy. So. Anyway, we got to get the season over. We're halfway through. Fabo, thanks for the follow. Yeah, it sucks because it's kind of that in-between state. I'm not really, really sick, and I'm not feeling good. So that in-between bullshit, I uh, haven't taken any DayQuil. I, uh, I did take a uh, Zyrtec for my allergies to help clear up my head, but it hasn't helped a ton yet. <laughs> Two guys there. He splits the difference. We're just going to go with six DBs the rest of this game. There we go. Bourbon and weed. Yeah. <clears throat> so I got COVID two weeks before everybody else got locked down. 
and it was it was fucking brutal the first three days i lost like 17 pounds in the first two days and it took me until that oh jesus it took me until that friday so i got sick on a sunday night until that friday or saturday that saturday that next saturday before i felt normal and could eat regular food and then i went to the doctor that monday after got a z-pack and i was good to go after two weeks and then uh everything got locked down so that sucked it's like all right i'm healthy let's go and no everybody gets to stay home for two years fucking ridiculous Somebody get him. There we go. That was a covered sack. We double teamed that halfback in the middle of the field, and I let my my CPU D lineman go get this guy. <clears throat> yeah, I got I got some really spicy food. I have uh, I have leftover uh, Hornitos lime uh, burrito mix. So it's it's uh, chicken and rice and onions and a bunch of hot seasonings and shit. Um, and, uh, oh, shit. I thought he was going to go back the other way. So I can always heat that up. Plus I got some, uh, some uh, Mexican hot sauce, not fucking sriracha or, uh, what's that other shit? Knucklehennies. How did you get burned so bad? And then he doesn't tackle! That's a fucking cord again. <clears throat> Bar Louie wings? Yeah. I like B-Dub's uh, mango habanero. Give me a, a tall fucking blue moon. Or two. Or three. And about 16 mango habanero wings, and we're good. And we're not talking regular wings. I, I boneless. I can't eat the fucking wings with bones in them. I'm, I'm. My son can do that all day long, and he can have them. I hate them. Too much fucking work, man. <clears throat> all right, we got to kill five minutes, guys. I think we've done that. We've killed four and a half minutes from their 40 before. Let's not run this back. Yeah, please tackle me. Thank you. Get up to a two-score lead. Run at least four minutes off this clock. They love to run blitz on first down. And three guys can't block that one DB. Three guys let him by. <laughs> oh, this controller's driving me insane. I moved that guy far out to keep that corner from undercutting the uh, tight end. <clears throat> You're going to the combine? Nice. Why is my stream stopped? It's lagging like a bitch. Don't split this stream in two. Refresh, guys. Refresh. Seriously, keep refreshing because it's a whole play behind. We'll take that. What's he up to? 96? Yeah, we got to get him over his 100 yards. Chance for another two. 
Let's let some of this clock just slowly tick, 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 tick off, right? Like this. Nice. Bosa and Randall signed the ball. Good. Yeah, closest thing I ever came to a combine was when my son was, um, when he was a sophomore in high school. No. No, he was a freshman in high school. When he was a freshman in high school, Devin Williams, the pitcher for the Brewers, um, was playing for our high school. Um, and my son was working out with the guy that coached him to uh, improve his hitting. And uh, we saw him pitch at a like prospects combine for uh, people in the area for colleges and pro scouts. And dude was touching 96 as a high school senior. And now his best pitch is a changeup. Yeah, Bryce Young. Yeah. Hey, as long as they can play, it doesn't matter how tall they are. It really doesn't. Look at Kyler Murray. Push. There we go. Ricky Bobby Terry, our backup running back, getting his first carry of the game. <clears throat> just gonna let this clock, we're gonna not put on chew clock, we'll just manually chew this clock. <laughs> Yeah, I wonder if Kyler Murray would be in the major leagues now if he had stayed with the Oakland A's instead of going to the uh, NFL draft. Definitely wouldn't have as big a contract as he has now. <clears throat> All right, now they're going to burn their timeouts. Yeah, exactly. So they're going to burn timeouts. I don't mind kicking a field goal here because it would be a two-score lead. I want to get rid of their timeouts. And make sure we get it in the end zone or through the uprights, one or the other. And they're just going to let him score. That's five rushing touchdowns for Robinson. Six on the day, five for him on the ground. Yeah, they let us walk in and score. They got 213 left. Fucking controller again. Oh, man, South Carolina beat Mizzou. That sucks. TCU lost. We want to see TCU lose. Volleyball. I just, uh, President's Day weekend, I did 26 matches in three days. My feet were killing me by the time I got done. Uh, it was my first big tournament since my ankle surgery, and I'm not sure I can handle doing those big tournaments right now. I also have to go see a neurologist in about two weeks, they're going to do some testing to see if I have uh, some neuropathy going on, especially my right foot, um, so they can figure out what's causing it so we can treat it and uh, get rid of the, uh, the pressure and the tightness. And It's not really a pain, it's more of a pressure issue, but anyway, got to go do that test so we can figure out how to treat it, otherwise we're just throwing darts in the dark trying to figure out what's causing it. But um, I have two more of those big tournaments coming up in March, later in March. There we go. User sack. And uh, I don't know that I can work all three days. Maybe I'll work Friday, off Saturday, work Sunday. I don't know. We'll see. It sucks because those are $1,000 weekends, man. Yeah, I did see that comment. And, you know, everybody shits on the Cardinals in the Cardinal way. And I still shit on their general manager because we've needed a 
We've needed this fucking controller again. We've needed a, a, a stud. All right, I have no control over this now. I couldn't switch off that one linebacker. Come on, wake up. Yeah, there's a short in this court. There you go, Pierre. Nice tackle. <clears throat> yeah, we just had state wrestling um, last weekend or last week. Also applied for a job with the Cardinals. Did not get it. Applied for a job at a, a local high school here. Yeah, probably won't get that one either. I'm looking to uh, get back into working full time and, and doing uh, less or no refing and just having a regular job where I don't have to stand on my feet for 14 fucking hours a day. <clears throat> Plus, I'm tired of all the bitching. I'm really fed up with the fucking bitching and moaning every time. It's a goddamn federal case every time something does and go their way. This tournament I did downtown, I was doing all of the uh, high-level 16, 17... Fucking go down, bitch! Three times I hit this guy. He will not go down. I'm doing these high-level 16, 17s, and 18s. It's, it's essentially like college-level volleyball for high school players. And the amount of fucking and crying and complaining is just out of hand. No, I coached I coached uh, select baseball for 13 years. We sent 10 kids to uh, play college baseball, and uh, it's just it's a grind. It's a fucking grind. I'm trying to get these guys to uh, cover. Trying to get these guys to listen to you sometimes is is a fucking pain in the ass. I liked being the bench coach more than out on the field so I can talk to these guys during the game when we're batting and talk to them about situational play and this and that. And, and uh, Fuck you guys, I'm calling a timeout because my defense is tired and I want to call what I want to call and not be rushed. Yeah, the problem, Nathan, is I never played volleyball. They didn't have didn't have boys volleyball when I was growing up. <laughs> Plus, the worst coaches are coaches that are referees. <laughs> I have more trouble with coaches that are referees than I do the other ones. And you look at me like, are you fucking kidding me? You know how this works. You know the rule. You know that's not right. Oh, they just fucking drive me insane. Why are you bitching? And then I had a college coach. So I had her for a couple of matches this past fall. And she also coaches club. And I ran into her at this tournament. And she's like, she's like, yeah, I had to ref because I'm, I'm coaching 13s and 14s. And I had to get up and stand and rough. And she's like, yeah, I'm not going to complain to you guys very much anymore because it, it's not easy. I'm like, damn fucking right it's not easy. There's, there's four people on the court, and that's if you have two referees. Four people on the court that have to be perfect every fucking play. Both referees and both setters. Everybody else can fuck it up, and everybody's like, oh, great point. If you're not perfect as a setter or a referee, then you're shit, right? Goddamn ridiculous. Go down. Thank you. <clears throat> What do we want to run? No, 
We're not running that setup play. We're going to run this play. Somehow they marched all the way down the field and didn't burn that one timeout. Isn't that amazing? CPU has such great timeout skills. They never waste a timeout. They always get 10 yards, hustle up, 10 yards, hustle up, get out of bounds. They never burn a timeout. I want my rushing yards. What's he at? Yeah, now we can just let the clock run out. I don't want to fuck up my quarterback's, uh, his uh, rushing average by running the ball. There we go. <laughs> yeah, these coaches are fucking terrible. Half the time, they don't even know the fucking rules of the sport that they're 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 coaching. It's amazing how many times I have to explain a rule to someone. No, no, you have that exactly wrong. This is the rule. Go look it up. <clears throat> All right, it only took us an hour and eighteen minutes to get this dub. 56 to 49. Took forever. I'm going to write that down. Two seventy six, two touchdowns, no picks, no sacks. Look at that. 31 carries for 200 yards. Five touchdowns. And a sixth here. Three by that guy, two by that guy. So nice. We had eight TFLs, two sacks. Should have had more. One pick. Should have had more TFLs, but the fucking game doesn't want us to tackle. So, God. Give up 49 points. That's the second time we've given up over 42 this year. We've given up 31, 42, 35, 52, 17, 21, and 49. We lost to Auburn 42, 52. <laughs> <laughs> yeah coaches see my problem when I coached baseball was you would ask them to explain a call and they wouldn't they'd just be they'd just walk away they wouldn't answer and it's like how can you make that fucking call and so as an official I go the opposite way I talk too much to them and I explain too much to them but I'd rather us have a conversation and you tell me what you saw, I'll tell you what I saw, we can agree to disagree, but at least you have a better understanding of what happened on the call, right? So I had someone bitching at me that weekend. Girl drives the ball, and it hits the top of the tape. Two girls go up to block, and it hits the tape. It doesn't hit their hands and go down, it hits the tape. And I call four touches because the third hit was in the tape, and then they hit it back up thinking it was blocked. And he was screaming at me, no, 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 they got it. Anyway, so after the match is over, he's like, oh, no, you did a great job. I'm like, why are you fucking yelling at me then? But I'm like, look, from where I'm looking at, that's on the other side of the net. It's on the far side of the net. That's not an easy call for me, and I don't have an art. I don't have a down ref. That's an adult. I have a fucking 16-year-old girl that's not paying attention. So you have a great angle at that. And all I can call is what I see. So if I see it hit the tape and come down, it's going to be four touches. And so he's like, oh, you know, all right, I understand. Um, what's up, Tight Spot? How you doing, man? We uh, we are lacking on the shout outs today. <clears throat> all right. Philip Morris is going to play quarterback. In North Carolina for Duke. <laughs> How funny is that? Philip Morris is their quarterback. That Jeff Brown is not going to play wide receiver. He's going to play halfback. 
and we got the other guard. So we just need two receivers, a D tackle, two outsides, and both corners that are left. We only need one corner, but we're going for both. Yeah, Philip Morris was the uh, number one QB on the board. <clears throat> max these guys out yeah. we could get this guy too but I don't need him I literally don't need him 84 throw power 84 accuracy here let's let's go to the uh, good old depth chart here and I'll show you what I'm talking about because we have this guy this guy starting I mean I'll probably let this junior go so it doesn't make sense to add a, another quarterback. We don't need another quarterback. And this is why I'm trying to get two running backs. We have two juniors that are going to be seniors, and then we got this guy. So the running backs I definitely need. And need two wide receivers because this needs help. And you can see why I'm trying to get as many corners as possible because we're a little light down here. <clears throat> So, this guy. Kyle Hunt, he's balanced, and so is the other guy. He's a five-star. He's balanced, but he's uh, 76 speed. I'll take that. 95 throw power, 82 accuracy. So... 76, I can work with guys in the 70s. I don't need to run them all the time. Now, the quarterback we had at Iowa when we were, we won five natties in a row, <clears throat> that dude had like 95 speed and 95 throw power. He was he was broken. If you want to see a real quarterback, scroll down. Scroll up on your phone or on your browser and click the Iowa stream playlist and go watch Desmond Maxwell. That fucking dude was crazy. All right. So, yeah, we're going to let somebody else have Kyle Hunt. Don't need him. <clears throat> Don't need this guy. Yeah. Yeah, we recruit way better than Iowa does. And we're going to throw points on this guy because Kenny Wallace, imagine Kenny Wallace playing in Carolina too. You know, NASCAR. I know Kenny Wallace is from St. Louis, but... We're going to throw this dude on the board and try and steal him. This guy's a Juco. Don't need him. D end. We need one D tackle. Where are we at with this guy? Yeah. We can let both these guys go. Because I'm not throwing points on those guys. I'll let somebody else have them. Now this dude... What do I have defensive end wise? I have four freshmen and two sophomores. And he's better than the sophomores, so. What the hell? Let's see if we can get an insta commit. Now he's a Juco. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get rid of him. I don't need him as a Juco. Those sophomores will be up that high. Alright, we'll throw points on him just to make sure we don't lose out. All right. We can totally rework. Because if I get this guy, what is this guy? This guy's a white. They say he's a wide receiver. 92 speed. 79 elusive. Eh, spin move, juke move, carry, stiff arm. His break tackle's not great. I could see him playing wide receiver. I could also see him playing running back. So, what these. He's going to commit this week. He's going to commit this week. Who has no scholarship? I'm waiting on him. I'm waiting on him. All right. There's no point in offering these two guys because we have insta commit, so we'll just wait. Where do we stand here? <clears throat> All right. One, five, three, four, seven threes. We're only a two star.
and we're up to number 15. So here's the deal. That loss was to Auburn. It's non-conference, right? We're 3-0 in conference. We already beat Vatek. Playing Virginia next. Pretty much this is the rest of our schedule. So we run run the table here. That makes us 11-1, right? Probably have to play Miami. And uh, we already beat them 34-17 last stream. Uh, we do not have Clemson on the schedule. We don't have Florida State on the schedule. Uh, we beat Louisville 31-21. We don't have UCF. We... we uh, we moved UCF to the ACC back when I was head coach after they won the Natty and kicked Wake Forest out. Um, Syracuse, we don't play. Boston College, we don't play. So the rest of our schedule is all division games. So hold on one sec. Game changed. All right, I'll have to check that. I had a I had a high school game change, so I gotta figure out when it got moved to. All right, let me save this. Yeah, tight spot. The way I go after quarterbacks is I go to athletes. I sort by 40 time. I start at the top of the list, and I look for B throw power. So I want the fastest guy with B throw power, and if they have B accuracy, that's even better. And hopefully not D elusive. What's up, Spectre? How you doing, man? <clears throat> so like this. I'll show you real quick before we get into this next game. I'm just going to go athlete because uh, it'll make it easier. I don't have to bring in everybody else. <clears throat> All right. So we sort by 40 time. And we go down to throw power. Now, Nick Wade, we're going after him as a wide receiver, right? What are we going after him as? Oh, we don't have him on the board. Yeah, we're way back. But you look for B throw power. <laughs> you're playing... You're playing Fortnite, I guess. Pimp Night. So all I'm doing is looking at the bottom, D throw power. Yeah, I'm just looking in that one spot and all I want to be. Like this guy is perfect. This guy is perfect. B throw power, B accuracy, B elusive, C carry, right? You know, Ohio State's gonna get him, but that's what I look for. And he runs a 4.48 with B throw power and B accuracy. And the fact that he has 330 bench press makes his throws better. <laughs> <clears throat> so that guy would be absolutely perfect as a user quarterback. In fact, I got points to spend. Let me uh, let, let's go look and see what his his ratings are. I'll put him on the board, even though we're not going to get him, and just see what his uh, see what he is. <clears throat> this guy Turner right yeah no I'm not I can't I can't yeah it sucks I can't put him on the board all right all right Specta we beat Vatek 56 to 49 my running back had five rushing touchdowns and one receiving touchdown <clears throat> let's go beat up VA look they got a better offense than they got a better team than we do all right, we're not going to use this controller because it's giving me so much problems during the game. Let's see what they have. Yeah, let's go with orange with them because uh, I don't want too much black going on or too much blue going on here.
And we'll go with the blue helmet. All right, let's go. <clears throat> Spec that we have five games left in the regular season. And if we win out, we're going to go to the ACC championship game again. In fact, you guys need to see this. Look at this. All right, the first year at Texas Tech, we finished third. Ever since then, we have finished first in our conference every fucking year. Every year. All those red years are natties. So every fucking year. And we lost this natty right here on a Hail Mary. Go check my clips. It's in there. I lost on a Hail Mary to my old school. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, finished first place in our conference every year but one mm. so we uh doesn't matter what fucking sliders we play on we have very very high standards and that's why i lose my shit so i gotta get some water so i'll be right back guys one second Sorry about that. I also grabbed some Dayquil while I was at it. Hope get me through the rest of this stream. Yeah, I expect that there'll be uh, no NWO games until they fix uh, an update for Hen. So you might get to see me stream more at night where they normally would be playing their games. And we got to put a little, uh, <clears throat> put a little caffeine in my water so I can stay awake. <coughs> oh. All right, let's go. Spectre, we need a little luck. Cross your fingers that we can get, uh, into the top five here soon enough so that we can uh, maybe steal a shot at the natty here in year two. <clears throat> Danny has some exciting news, does he? I haven't talked to him since uh, he gave me shit for talking about the uh, kick six too much. The Blue Devils are lined up for the kickoff. Had back to return. Is it football news or is he getting married? <clears throat> Wouldn't let me pick my play. All right. We're going to go run. Yeah, 
Fucking go down. God damn. He's going to be a papa? Ah, oh, cool. Good for him. He'll be a great dad. There we go. Got a sack. Off the edge. That little chime. I have a baseball draft that's going on. And uh, that means somebody just made a pick. Let me see if you guys can see this or not. No, it's not the right one. All right, never mind. It won't, it won't recognize that one. So I got two more picks, then I'm up. And the guy I wanted just got taken. There's so many pitchers left. Maybe I say fuck it and I go take a second baseman instead and that'll fill my infield up. I do not want to take Byron Buxton. Dude is fucking trash. And uh, no. <laughs> no. <clears throat> it's, uh, yeah, it's a fancy baseball draft. I already had uh, my keepers were Pete Alonzo, Rafael Devers, uh, Anthony Santander, um, Framber Valdez, and Ryan Presley. And whatever round you pick them in, if you keep them the next year, then you lose the round earlier than that. So if I took somebody in like the 10th round, um, the next year, if I keep them, then it's the ninth, I lose my ninth round pick. If I keep them again, then it's the eighth round. And if I keep them for three years, then it's the seventh round. So I've had uh, Devers and Alonzo for the last three years. This will be my fourth year because we're not counting the COVID year. So... <clears throat> So I will have had Pete Alonso his entire career up to this point. Um, and I took, I had the number two pick, and I took uh, Trey Turner over Acuna because shortstop, there's a lot of shortstops that have been kept already. It's a very scarce position in our league. And he had the same or better stats than Acuna, and I'd rather have it at short than the outfield. And uh, then on the way back, I took uh, Brandon Woodruff and uh, Sean Bieber. So I have Woodruff, Bieber, Valdez, and Presley in my red, in my uh, pitching staff right now. Ooh. Yeah. Alonzo has to go back next season. Ian Devers, Devers, and uh, Presley, those three guys have to all go back. <laughs> yeah, the COVID year, I finished second. So I, was, I, I won some money. That was nice. Yeah, you can draft him again. But the problem is other people can step in and draft him too. And uh, you can't keep your uh, you cannot keep your first round pick. If you keep your second round pick, you lose your first. So it has to be a pretty damn good second round pick in order to lose a first rounder. Go down! God damn this fucking game! It's had fifty halfback. 50 halfback ability. It's not 90, it's 50, and this motherfucking game will not let me tackle. <sighs> Spectre, there is there is uh, no no tequila today. I'm not mixing tequila and Dayquil, so. Fucking bullshit game.
That's fine. Give me time to uh, get my offense going. Because you know, with these sliders, you got to get them warmed up. Go, in motion, motherfucker. Go. What's up, Revamp? How you doing, man? Revamp, this dude, Robinson, had five rushing touchdowns and one receiving last game against Vatek, man. We could spec the. And he ran for almost 150 yards. How am I feeling? Um, half good, half bad. I just, I just couldn't uh, not play for two weeks. I could have streamed yesterday, but I was lazy as shit. And uh, I just want this season over with. God, give me that dude wide open over the middle. He's got no agility, though. <clears throat> hey, and with uh, you guys being stuck because of the uh, hen needing a hen update, I might stream more at night and in that spot where you guys normally play your games because um, sometimes I get shit done during the day and I can stream later at night. We could open middle of the field. This dude only has 89 speed, but he's he's a good player. There's a faster guy. Ricky Bobby Terry behind him is a much faster back. But uh, this guy's he's a good back. He can catch passes as well. That's really important. Look at him push through. Strong guy. How you feeling? You weren't feeling good recently either, man. <sighs> what do I want to do? Let's do this. Yeah, you know, those leagues are tough. Sometimes you really do need a break. Push through, there we go, split the D, touchdown. I need a little bit of a break too because I was calling a shit ton of games. But we're going to get to the point where I'm uh, refing high school again starting on the 21st. And I won't have those evenings open because I won't get home till like 7.30. I could do the late games. I knew that dude. That's why I used the safety. I thought he was going to go deep and I was going to have to cover him. This is a run. Oh, and he cuts it fucking all the way back. Look at this dude. I do not know why I can't play run defense. I can't stop anybody. I can't break any. I can't shed a block. I can't tackle. Everybody's fucking Jim Brown out there. Go down. Hey Jimbo, these are uh, 
uh, 50 halfback ability. I do not have it set. Everything else is right around 90. I don't have 90 on the halfback ability. These fucking quarterbacks punching down my linebackers. That shit needs to stop. Jimmy. Jimmy with the, uh, the watch streak here. Welcome in, Jimmy. Gotcha, bitch. All right. Jordan Romano goes. So one more pick and then it's mine and I'll have to stop and make my pick. He just runs to the outside. Look at the blocking on this play. You see a shed block at all? You see one guy shed a block at all? This is the only guy making a play on the ball, and no one blocks him. Ninety-six speed and three acceleration and agility. Just can't can't change directions. <coughs> All right, we got man. Remember, this is a pocket passer. This guy is not a scrambler. Oh, hey, Jimbo, we signed uh, Philip Morris to play quarterback at Duke. 94 throw power? 96 throw power? This guy likes 76 speed, 78 speed, something like that. Is he warmed up yet? Can I run with him now? No. One more carry. I like this play, Jimbo, because this looks like a read option, and it's a straight up counter. And my wide receiver doesn't block the corner, so he just comes flying off the edge. Eighty just sucked and sold on that one. <clears throat> All right, we got five on five in the box. Hold your block. Give me your lane. Thank you. All right, third and three. We'll take that. If I had more speed, I'd have got the first down. And we're just gonna let the clock run out, and we'll be done with the first quarter. Look at this dude, wide fucking open. 
<laughs> Woo, everybody bit on the uh, mesh, and they left the out wide open for a touchdown. Look at this play. Their defense was totally... This linebacker's coming way over to cover the halfback. I've got both both uh, drags wide open right here. I could have hit either guy on the drag. And this guy's going deep up the middle to take care of the safety. And they just left this dude wide open. But look at this. I could have hit this guy too. He's wide open. If I hit him right there... Jeez. I don't know what defense they were in, but it was the wrong one. <laughs> Most definitely the wrong one for that one. Yeah, I was looking at that out route all day. I was looking to see how they were going to cover him. If they cover him, I was going to dump it to the halfback or see if there was a drag open. And once I saw no one cover him, as soon as he made his cut, that ball was blistered outside. Get it to him and let him run, because I know that guy has a ton of speed. So I just got to get it to him and let him run away from the safety. <clears throat> Man, pressure got there. Come on, go down. That's an extra 10 fucking yards. I can't get a tackle from anybody. No one will go down when I hit them. I'm not hitting square. I'm hitting X. It won't fucking tackle. <clears throat> now you know why I want to leave this school. What a fucking pancake that was. You see him just run that dude right the fuck over? Oh my god. Fucking pulling guard just stood there and watched the linebacker shoot the gap. He just looked at him. No fucking attempt at all. That was a stupid fucking decision. Caught it. Wow. I didn't get my feet set. Well, you know we're going to go for it. I did, not, I did not get my feet set, and he's lucky he made that catch. Wow. Throw the ball. Press the button, he won't throw the ball. Should have called. 
completely different play. Go down! God! What do I have to do to tackle? I'm spamming X. It won't tackle anybody. Won't fucking tackle a soul. And then everybody gets picked off. Punch in the face. <clears throat> that I'm looking up the field trying to cover this dude running straight up the middle <clears throat> please be holding Offensive pass interference. <laughs> there we go. It's because the uh, lineman was downfield. See if they can uh, hit a 23 yard dot here. <clears throat> You're going to go for this or you're going to kick the field goal? 52 yards, huh? Give me that ball by midfield. As soon as I saw him pressing, <laughs> all goddamn day long. Face mask? There we go. 15 more. <coughs> Nothing like throwing in a triple coverage and get a face mask out of it. Look at this dude just walk through the line. It was five on three, and he just walked through the line. Four down territory, for sure. <clears throat> I love when they press when you do slants. As soon as they break the press, just fire it as hard as you can.
God, if we could ever stop the run, we might run away with these games. the wrong hole <laughs> I saw that inside tackle run I was like all right we're gonna hit over here and he went to the right when I was on the left guys refresh your stream it's lagging again Go down! Always KD. Welcome in, guys. Welcome, welcome. How you doing, KD? I know you're playing Hogwarts. <clears throat> Shout him out. Welcome, welcome, guys. So, we're struggling to play run defense, KD, because the fucking game, every time I hit them, they won't go down. They won't go down. I'm... I'm I don't feel good. I'm still sick. I can't drink tequila because I took some meds, so we're just dealing with this bullshit. Welcome in, guys. How's Hogwarts? I, I've seen a little bit of people playing it. That's uh, that's a game. That's a game my uh, daughter would absolutely love. <clears throat> lagging like a mofo. Yeah, my stream's been lagging today. The game has been okay, but. I don't play on uh, PC either, so I have a little bit different issues. Oh my. There's a draw play for a first down because he won't go down. Hey, we stopped him. Called the timeout. <coughs> Yeah, 140. He's got like half those yards on one play. All right, always run, punt return, safe man. We have 32 fake punts run by the CPU right in this range between the 40s. Always run, safe man. You're actually going to get a better... Um, there's a face mask. Call that. You're going to get a better uh, rush out of it too. I don't know why. Welcome in, guys. Tight end, get us a first down, get out of bounds. <laughs> Run those little out routes. Shallow out. Love this smash play. See what they want to do. Okay. Don't want to cover the streak guy. I'll take that all day. What's the flag for? Personal foul. Face mask. <laughs> they want the ball back they want the ball back before half because they know we're going to score look at this play <clears throat> alright so this tight end does an angled out and he's covered All right, that's my first read <clears throat> if they press this guy send him on the streak they play off we run a uh, a, a, uh, <clears throat> a slant and he's running through too much traffic. Although I could throw it there. And I probably would have thrown it there. And then you got 86 doing this little out right here along the sidelines. So that's a safe throw. And they have three guys covering this receiver. And they just split like the Red Sea. When did I throw this pass? Look at that guy coming right at me. He's going to hit me. I threw the ball right there.
And now we have lag because I did the uh, <clears throat> because I did the replay here. Hold on. That should fix it. That makes it first and goal. Larry, Larry, Larry. Mike 56, Mike 56. Nope, still got lag. That's all right, we'll take the touchdown. We're trying to get rid of this lag, guys. It took us 30 seconds. Nope. Well, we're just going to have to play with lag the rest of the game. <clears throat> mm, kickoff was a little bit better. Can we play any defense? Any semblance of defense? Look at this shit. We play cover four and no one plays deep. No one fucking plays deep. Where's the corner? Where's the guy playing deep? Thank God we can fucking play offense. That's all I gotta say. <clears throat> this fucking game. is terrible guys the lag is not the stream it's the game right now so I'll tell you when the uh, stream is lagging this is because we ran too many too many replays block that guy thank you get up the sidelines get out of bounds love when that tight end blocks the DB <laughs> Yeah. 
Vince Vaughn makes, makes the tackle. tackle. That's, That's good, good for a gain of 25, 25 yards. yards. That makes it first and 10. So I'm going to stop the clock. I was looking for somebody open over the middle, but if I'm not going to get it open over the middle, we're just going to run. Get a timeout. Like going out of bounds. <clears throat> First down. All right, hold on. It's my pick. Manoa went. All right. Pitchers, hitters, all. I could take another pitcher, but I don't get a pick next round. I need an outfielder. Or a second baseman. Fourth round. I don't want to take a catcher in a fourth round. Don't want Byron Buxton because the dude's always fucking hurt. Always fucking hurt. <clears throat> second yeah not getting Rizzo so the options are uh, Starling Marte a little bit of everything I could go another pitcher and get you Darvish to go with uh <clears throat> Woodruff, Bieber, and Valdez. Although I think I'm going to wait. I don't like Buxton at all. <clears throat> we get Tyler O'Neill, but I think I'd rather have the Steels. But Marte just had surgery on both of his groins, so. I don't need a corner guy just yet. Jimenez. I could take Jimenez. Torres at second. Could take Carlos Correa. Really fuck up the shortstop options. Marte. I need outfield though. Really bad. All right. I don't pick again next round. My pick next round is Rafael Devers, who was a keeper. So I don't pick till the sixth round. <clears throat> All right, let's just go hitters. Reese Hoskins is out there. Uh, I don't need him, though. Really don't want Buxton. Take Jimenez to play second base. Starling Marte. Give me more steals. Take Jose Abreu, but he's playing in Houston. Take Korea. Stanton's still out there. I'm sure he'll be gone by the time he gets back to me. Hmm. I think I'm going to make those guys wait and not make my pick. <clears throat> we have eight hours to make a pick. So they're just going to have to wait. Yeah, it's a slow draft. Nobody takes eight hours, but in case you're busy working and don't have time. 
Oh, there we go. Fit that shit straight in there. Nice reach back catch right between two defenders. Got four touchdown passes in the half. Yeah, we almost got through two rounds the first day. But they can wait. Because I don't get to pick again. So when it comes back, I'm picking second. So it's a snake draft. So the guy finished first is going to pick twice. And then my Devers keeper kicks in. So I got to wait for it to go all the way down and come all the way back before I pick again. So I'm going to take my fucking time. <clears throat> Look at this, 35 points and a half. We did that last game, we scored 56. We just can't play defense on these sliders, man. Well, we're definitely not playing cover four because the motherfucker can't keep up. So we'll give them uh, over the top help. Look at this bullshit. Fuck you. <coughs> we snuck them. They thought they were going to get that long run in the half. We were just baiting them, right? This guy, he has no agility whatsoever. He's a straight line wide receiver. <clears throat> All right, it is time to grind. We almost had 300 yards passing in the first half. Get off of me. Get that outside block. There we go. He's still not down. There we go. Second and one. Roger, Roger. Mike 56, Mike 56. Coming to you, coming to you. Took away my pitch. I'll take 12 yards right up the gut. Held my guy up. I had to wait for him to clear that linebacker that was holding. <clears throat> I did that just so I can run. There you go. Five on five. Hold your block. That was at NWO four yards. That makes it Looks like about one or two, and it's four. And hit sticking, trying to make me fumble. 
Look at that. Because we're lagging, I don't trust my kicker. So we're going to go for this. Otherwise, I'd just go ahead and take the points and make this a, a two-score game. <clears throat> that play is so easy. Watch for the man. The man's coming to get you. And I kind of took away that edge. So I was trying to cut it back and get something on the backside. Always down to the one. Another one yard touchdown run coming up, guys. That makes it third and goal. I guess we chewed three minutes off the clock there. There we go. All right, two score game. Let's see if we can get rid of this lag one more time. Maybe. It might have done it. That might have done the trick. That was a really fast uh, meter, so let's hope. Let's hope. Still on lag. Literally cannot stop the run no matter what fucking play call I make. So here's what's going to happen. They're going to score fast every time they have the fucking ball, and we're just going to have to eat clock and make this game get done. God, I can't wait to get through with this game because the lag is just atrocious. motherfucker will never go down. I can't tackle this guy no matter what I do. Three catches for 139. He refuses to go down on contact. Lemon Larry, thanks for the follow. Appreciate that. Look at 
this. I hit him in the hole. I hit him in the hole. No gain on the play. That brings up second and goal. Coach Larry, hey, welcome in, man. Teach me how to play run defense because I can't seem to tackle anybody in this fucking game. Every time I hit them, they just spin off or punch me in the face. <laughs> or they leave them wide open in the corner of the end zone. Oh, thank God I can play offense. That's all I gotta say. They've only thrown eight passes the whole fucking game and three touchdowns. <laughs> oh, I hate this game. <laughs> It doesn't matter what formation, what play. This team will, will not tackle anyone. Will not tackle anyone. I don't even think it counts all of the broken tackles in this game. <sighs> Fucking. Because of the lag, it's not going to let me look at stats. It's just going to scroll through. <clears throat> I need revamp TV or uh, Coach Brousseau to help me out on defense. Yeah, I just took this team over last year, so we don't have uh, anybody on the team playing that we recruited. Um, they're all being redshirted, so uh, maybe next year. We got our 300 yards passing. We're just going to run so we eat time. Ah, waited too late. I was looking, looking, looking. I didn't like the two crossing routes. Tried to hit the uh, over the middle. Not with this team. Here. Yeah, this team we just took over. We went 12-2. and two. Now, all of these other teams, yeah, we've won a lot of natties. Just not with this one. We just took this team over. Well, I'm also playing on different sliders than I used to play on too, so that's part of my problem. Let's go. Bring the fucking heat. Please bring the heat. This will be a walk-in touchdown that bring the heat. There it is. Push. Get in there. Oh, all the way. Yeah, he did. They gave him credit. Touchdown. <laughs> Fell on top of that dude. Here, let's watch the replay. It's a great pancake block right there. I had to set up another block here. And we just had to push through the pile and land it on top of someone. And they're going to say I'm short. They're going to say I'm short. There we go. Always, we always get stopped at the one on the pass plays. 
I lead the world in one yard touchdown runs. It's not even close. Yep. I think his name was Bobby Terry, and I changed it to, I kept calling him Ricky Bobby Terry, so we just officially changed it to Ricky Bobby Terry. He's not down yet, but he is right there. So he's a yard short. That's okay. He never made it to the end zone. <laughs> Let the clock wind down. A walk in. Touchdown. Easy touchdown for Adam. He deserves a touchdown after the day he's had. He had five rushing touchdowns last game. We're just going to have to outscore everybody. The lowest point total we've had all year is 31. So Defense can't uh, help out. The offense is going to have to carry the load, right? <clears throat> I'm just going to hit X and let the uh, computer pick my defense since we uh, struggle. Thank God the CPU tackled him for me because I got hung up on a block. <clears throat> All right, off to the fourth. If we can make them burn some time, then we can pretty much run out the rest of the game. Hey! Bronx cheer. We held them to two. It's probably the lowest... Run total, he's had the entire game. Love when they do us a favor by tackling themselves by running out of bounds. It's always fun. All right, third and four. Caught up in the wash. That's not even the guy you're supposed to cover. He's supposed to cover the halfback. They never go down. They always gain their balance. They always stumble forward, pick up another five, six yards, you know. 
amazing. Fucking amazing. I actually don't mind if they score here. Why did 36 go for the quarterback? We had three guys on the quarterback. His job is to cover the edge. No, I'm just going to come in and try and cut this quarterback off instead of staying outside, make the quarterback keep the ball, run inside where the pursuit is. No, we're just going to come in and let him get the easy pitch and walk in. <clears throat> They've thrown the ball 10 times the whole game. Nice pancake. Get outside. Get that block. Does he got enough speed? Does he have enough speed? Does he have enough speed? Yes, he does. To the fucking house. It's his second of the day. Not this game. Second in the stream. All right, Coach, you call the defense. Let's see what they want. Three down, three down. So Mike number one, Mike number one. Three down. <coughs> I'm not hitting circle. Unless I have to, we're just going to spam X. And, of course, blow his fucking leg out. If I can tear that ACL. Instead of being stubborn, oops, wrong one. And this motherfucker won't go down either. Look at this. It takes the entire defense to bring this guy down. They were going to run the counter. As soon as I run unbalanced and everything's off to the right, that's why I made sure they. Uh, I changed the defense up a little bit to. Uh, base a line. Should have had him way, way back there. Anybody fucking tackle on this team? Anybody? Anybody? Do I have to tackle every fucking try? 
Can the CPU tackle for me? Or are we just fucking speed bumps out here? Back to back games of 49 points allowed. This was the final score of our previous game. This dude's going to win the uh, kick return award for the season. I'm letting this clock wind down. I'll be perfectly happy with a field goal here. <clears throat> He's down. Why do we why are we taking shots down the field? Third and four, yeah. Four verts. We're going four verts. Thank you for holding on to the ball, Arnold. If I don't have to throw the ball the rest of the game, I won't. But if I have to, I will. But if we can just grind this fucking thing out. Get six, seven yards on every carry. Yep, make him burn those timeouts. Keep this shit on the ground. <clears throat> oh, it's not going to give me the first down because he pushed me backwards. No forward progress. He shoves me backwards. Oh, this fucking game is... Garbage! <clears throat> I was two yards beyond the line of scrimmage. He pushes me back and then gives me that stupid jump animation. All right, now we can just grind this clock. <clears throat> that was all about keeping the ball in the middle of the field and burning clock. Yeah, no. This is the play we're going to call.
And we're just going to let this clock grind. They can't stop it. We'll end up kicking a field goal with about 10 seconds left in this game. Face mask. <laughs> Free first down. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Face mask. Stay in bounds. Thank you very much. Doesn't score. There we go. We're going to call a timeout with two seconds left and punch this fucking thing in. Suck my dick, Virginia. God, I can't wait to get some defenders that can actually tackle on this team. Make a huge fucking difference. A double-crossing cocksucker. That's right, Jimmy and Spectre both know. We threw for 284 yards in the first half. And then we just ran in the second half, pretty much. All right. One more fucking game to go. And this one's against NC State. At home. And then uh, maybe tomorrow or tomorrow night, we got Pitt at Georgia Tech at North Carolina. So we can get through these four games. We'll be going to the ACC championship game for the second year in a row. <clears throat> 23 of 25, 392, four touchdowns, no interceptions, two sacks. Ran the ball 40 times for 186 yards and four touchdowns. Spread those passing around. Tackles, nobody tackled on this fucking team. Let's get back to the running game. All right. 27 carries for 349 yards and three touchdowns. Had four runs of over 20 yards, and they broke 10 tackles. And that's just the tackles that it counted. 10 broken tackles, just the ones they counted. <laughs> it's a damn good thing I know how to play offense. That's all I got to say. <clears throat> Jimmy, it's my pick in baseball, so let me know what you what would you do. So I have Alonzo, Devers, Trey Turner on the infield. Anthony Santander is one my one outfielder. Pitching, I have Framer Valdez, Brendan Woodruff, Sean Bieber as my starters, and Ryan Presley as my closer. And it's my pick. I need outfield really bad. I don't have a pick next round because that's where Devers gets taken. 
So I'm looking. I don't want Brian, Byron Buxton. The dude's always fucking hurt. So got Starling Marte who's coming off surgery. I could take a catcher, Salvador Perez, with 29 homers, 80 RBIs. Um, I could take Carlos Correa. I could take Giancarlo Stanton. Uh, it's too early for Tyler O'Neill. Outfield. Yeah, I need outfield. So outfield options are Buxton, Marte, MJ Melendez qualifies. Got Stanton, O'Neill. Don't like Stephen Kwan. Taylor Ward from the Angels. Chris Bryant, who's been injured. Nimmo. Not a fan of Nimmo. Castellanos is out there, but it's too early for him. <clears throat> I'm leaning towards Marte just to fill five categories. Yeah. Melendez, though, his average sucks. So if I'm going to take an average that sucks, I'll take Stanton because he's got a shot for 50, right? Um. Hoskins is out there. Andres Jimenez, the second baseman. He's 18 home runs, 28 RBIs, or 28 steals. Um, Carlos Correa is out there. I could always go pitcher again, take you Darvish. Um, Clay Kershaw. He doesn't pitch enough. Giolito, but his ERA sucks. I could go closer. Uh, Take Rizal, Rizal Iglesias. <clears throat> so, I, I really need a hitter. I really want to take. I mean, Ryan Mount Castle's out there at first base. Jose Abreu playing in Houston. Um, I just. Leaning towards Marte. It's just dudes had surgery on both groins. So how's that going to affect him stealing? Melendez <coughs> I can play catcher. And that's it. <coughs> <coughs> I'm in a tough spot here. To get another 200K guy with uh, Darvish. What's up, Coach King? Yeah, we're trying to come up with my draft pick. If I take Darvish, I'll have Valdez, Woodruff, Bieber, and Darvish. But that makes my outfield kind of weak. I have one outfielder. If I take Mount Castle, then um, I think it's a little early for him. And I've already got first base, so that takes my corner. There's other options to take a corner. It's just I need I need an outfield. I really don't want Buxton. That fucker is always hurt. <clears throat> yeah. Marte. I can come back and get some other guys later, but. Or I could just take Salvador Perez as a catcher. I just don't want to take him in the fourth round, man. I mean, he is what he is. I think I'll take Marte. I don't want to, but that'll give me more steals. Yeah, I hate fucking Buxton. I hate Buxton. Yeah, the dude. Let me see his stats. So. These are his at-bat totals in his career. As a rookie, 129. 2016, 298. 2017, 462. 2018, 90. 2019, 271. 2020, 120. 2021, 235. 2022, 340. <clears throat> Dude can't fucking stay healthy. And he only stole six bases last year. Yeah. <sighs> 
They do an SMU, yeah. That's really tough with those lower schools trying to get them back up. I just don't know. Even Stanton, hit 30 last two years. He's in the same boat. He doesn't give you enough at bats. Only at 211. Yeah, fuck. It's down between you, Darvish, and Marte. Do I just say, fuck outfield, I'll deal with it later, and just load up on pitching? I mean, Marte lifts me across the board in every category, but really so does Darvish. No, you don't lose points for strikeouts. <clears throat> I would be super deep. Hold on a sec. Team totals. I'm actually doing pretty good in pitching. I need I need an outfielder. I gotta take Marte. I gotta take Marte. All right, now I'm done drafting until sometime tomorrow. <clears throat> All right, made them wait long enough. Yeah, Castellanos is a good option. Um, even Jesse Winker late, late in the draft, playing in Milwaukee, which is a great hitter's park. Yeah, Coach, we uh, we beat Virginia Tech 56-49, and we just beat Virginia 63-49 because we can't stop the run. No matter what I do, it won't stop. Guys, make sure you refresh because it's lagging really bad right now. Seriously, re refresh twice. Refresh twice. Do it twice. It's it's really bad. <clears throat> All right, let's advance. So our only loss on the year was the first game of last stream when we lost to Auburn 52-42. So our totals, let's see. We beat Indiana 35-31. We beat Northwestern 52-42. We beat Houston 49-35. See a trend here? Lost to Auburn 42-52. Beat Miami, 34-17. Beat Louisville, 31-21. And then today, beat Vatek, 56-49. And Virginia, 63-49. So, we, we've had four games this year giving up 40-plus points. <clears throat> See what happens with NC State. <clears throat> yeah, the guy, Jimmy, the guy I wanted to take this round was taken like the second pick of the round, and that was uh, Eloy Jimenez. <coughs> With uh, Abreu gone, I think he's going to be a big bat in the middle of the lineup. He's lost some weight, so he can play some outfield. Now DH all the time. I'm still looking at Vaughn, their first baseman, who's only, I think he's only eligible at outfield this year, so I could always go get him. He's only like 24, so maybe I get him and he's my replacement for Alonzo. Hey, uh, Jimmy, know who's still out there that I'm looking to get in like maybe the 10th or 12th round is uh, Bryce Harper. I'm interested to see how long Bryce Harper waits before someone takes him since he's going to miss half the year. There we go, boys. We got both the outside linebackers we needed. And we got one of the two wide receivers. So now we're down to one wide receiver, one D tackle, and one corner. And that's it. <clears throat> We're looking for both the, both corners on the board, though, because they're better than the guy we got earlier. We got a 68, and if I can replace him with a 78, that makes it much better. <clears throat> All right. Derek Lester goes down here. Quentin Powell. There we go. 79 linebacker with uh, 88 tackle. That's what we need. 82 speed, 87 excel, 80 strength. This is what we need. This guy has 83 speed, 78 block shed. So, here, look, Jimmy, we got 
What did Harper do? He had uh, Tommy John. So you can't throw the ball. He can't bat right now. So he'll be out till uh, midseason. <laughs> Look, we got Philip Morris as our quarterback. 95 throw power. All right. So Kenny Wallace, 96 speed. Be nice to get him. Um, we need this guy. We need this guy. We need this guy. So we can get rid of Chad Joyce. Even though he has 96 speed, 58 catching. We don't need him. All right. So we need these five guys right here. We're going to over-recruit by three, but I don't give a fuck. Yeah, we need to replace this corner right here. Because he only has 88 speed. <clears throat> and this guy, 88 speed, only has 68 break tackle. So if we cut him, that's fine too. This guy's more of a D-tackle. <clears throat> Where are we at on here? I should probably go see if there's any other defensive ends. All right, we're number three still. Let's go see if there's any good DNs on low lock to replace that 68 that we got. Low lock and 73% locked. Let's see. We're just going to go sort by squat. Four thousand points is way too many points. He's only seventy-two speed. These are both Jucos. Low. Overall sucks. Too slow. All right, let's throw this guy back on the board because he runs a four six six. Not overly strong, but I'll I'll take the four six. Got it, this guy. 78 speed. Good pass rusher. Man, I'm not even going to worry about We'll just offer this dude right now. Get it out of the way. Anybody else we need to offer? Kenny Wall. Kenny Wall. Just offer and be done. All right, we're 14th. Let's go look at the top 25 because we haven't looked all day. <clears throat> Notre Dame's one. Army is two. Look at that. There's six-star school. Tennessee is three. They're a six-star school. Georgia's got a loss. Michigan State has a loss. Navy has a loss. Iowa, Jimmy, that's our old school. They're still a six-star. Arizona's a three-star. Oklahoma just lost to K-State. All right, we got a bunch of guys to jump over. There's only one undefeated team. One undefeated team. So we got to win out and uh, win the conference and hope some of these teams get a second loss and we can jump over some of these guys. Where are we at in the Heisman? <clears throat> All right, our running back's number two. Averaging 94 per game. He's already got 21 touchdowns. See, he's not a burner. Only 87 speed. But he has 94 agility, 90 excel, 84 break tackle, trucking. So he's a power back. Hey, look, Iowa's got a quarterback on there, Jimmy. <clears throat> Let's look at this roster. Guys hit 14, then 29, 18, 5. So if we stick around, 
This is year two, three, four, five. We're going to go up to a three star after the season. Then we'd go up. So we'd be a three star, then go up to a four star, go up to a five star. So if we stick around for five years, we'll be the number one team. But I don't know. Let's save this. Let's save this. Play this game and we're done. One more game. I already had three hours. We still got a game to go because I've been taking forever. One more game and we're done, guys. One more game. And uh, maybe we'll be back tomorrow to finish the regular season. And that would allow us to maybe Friday night, Saturday day, maybe play the postseason. All right, finally a team or better. Yeah, with this 81 overall team on 1090 sliders. <laughs> There's your old school revamp. Ice Wolf. Get one a little more color. Iron Wolf. Pack in black. Love these names. Yeah, let's give them the red. And we're going to go back in black, boys. Back in black. All right, here we go. <clears throat> Two, four, five, yeah, seven and one. Oh. I would have taken a double shot in the first game if I wasn't on Dayquil. <laughs> <clears throat> Hello, Zoo. Do you girls need to go outside? Come on. Get them birds and squirrels, huh? Yeah. My dogs always knock over my uh, backlights. Come on. All right, well, their tackle's out. Their middle linebacker is not going to play, but their halfback is. A little chilly, North Carolina. See that fr the uh, breath going on here. All right, four games left. We went twelve and two last year. <sighs> When's the last time I lost as many as three games with this fucking team? This this head coach. The last time we lost three games was the first year at Texas Tech. The Blue Devils are lined up for the kickoff. <clears throat> Somebody else just make a pick. There goes you, Darvish. Right after my pick, Jimmy. It was either Darvish or Marte. That chime is the draft. 
God damn, that's four guys. It took four guys to bring that motherfucker down. That brings up second and one. He took Darvish and Jose Abreu. So now it's my pick with Devers, and so I gotta wait for it to go down and come back. He's still not. What the fuck? <laughs> How is he not down? How is he not down right here? Dude's laying on the fucking ground right there. <clears throat> and then we give up this deep ass pass. And nobody can tackle! Nobody can fucking tackle! Nobody! Look at the tackle ratings in the corners. I <laughs> can't start twice on defense. Where the hell am I? Oh, I have this dude starting at outside linebacker. I have this free safety playing at outside linebacker. Because, you know. <laughs> All right. Tell you what. We're going to put this guy in at outside linebacker. And then we're going to put Roth back at free safety. <clears throat> We just, no one can fucking tackle on this team. Somebody else just got drafted. And there goes Buxton. <laughs> Fuck Byron, Byron Buxton. That dude is garbage. Somebody somebody tweeted last year a, a stat about his and tagged him. And he, like, replied. And I was like, the dude's had over 300 at-bats in a season once in his whole fucking career. One time. Not getting excited. When you can get 500 ABs in a season, we'll talk about how good you are. <clears throat> because uh, injury prone is a real thing, and it and uh, not getting injured is a fucking is actually a uh, is a uh, skill, right? <laughs> if you're always fucking hurt, how how uh, valuable are you? Well, yeah, no, you're not. Not paying anybody $20 million to sit on a bench and jerk off half the season. Got him. Fuck you. Off the edge with the heat. Look at this. Boom. Pierre Jefferson with the sack off the edge. There you go, Pierre. The 
got to be on the field to help your team. If you're sitting on the fucking bench or in the locker room, you help nobody. <clears throat> yeah, Pierre was bitching about being on the team. I put him on the team and now he's not in here. Hey, there you go. Clemson lost. Florida State. What do you know? We held him to three, guys. Fucking miracles do happen. This guy's ran a kickback for a touchdown in every game of this stream so far. It's not going to happen on that one. <clears throat> nice hit. <laughs> That's hilarious. Lou has my favorite uh, saying from Twitch. Read the fucking room. Read the room. You did not read the room. One thing I can do is play fucking offense, so we uh, we know we're going to score points on everybody. And this is a 81 fucking. <laughs> Why do people do that? Oh, he had the step. He just couldn't hang on. That was going to be a big fucking play. I can't believe I caught that ball. That should have been a pick. And you know we're going to go for it. <sighs> which play? Which play? Which play? They expect us to run. Look at that. 3-3-5. Three, three, How did he drop the ball? He was in his hands. <sighs> this fucking game. <laughs> yeah, people give me shit. And, and they probably give me shit behind my back for uh, banning people so quick. But, um... This is my fucking stream, all right? And if you're going to come in my stream and be a fucking little bitch, then you're going to go away. There we go. This isn't a democracy. It's a complete dictatorship, man. This is my fucking stream. And uh, we'll do it my way. And if you like it, great. And if you don't, click that little X and get the fuck out. All right? I've said that from day one. I put up with enough bullshit in real life. I ain't putting up with it doing this for fun. Nice throw. That's a nice throw. Remember that dude who came in here one day? And uh, he followed me. He followed me, and then I dropped a few F-bombs right after he followed me. And then his first thing was co complaining about my language, and I was like, Oh, catch the ball! I was like... I, I saw it. Jimmy saw the comment. I let it go. I was talking a little bit. He said something else, and I'm like, you talking to me? <laughs> no one made you fucking follow me, so I banned his fucking ass right away. He just pushed the defensive end down. 
Yeah, you guys could see me looking to the camera or see me looking over here at chat going, really? Is that is that how we're going to play this? Because this is going to end one way. Got him! Yes! Yes! Two big sacks on two drives. <laughs> Are you talking to me? I just wanted, I knew he was talking to me. I just wanted him to, uh, I just wanted him to make the uh, confirmation for me so I could just say, okay, all right. Well, guess what? Fuck you. I'll tell you the same thing I tell my wife about dropping F-bombs. It's just a word. And if you don't like it, that's your fucking problem, not mine. Bring the heat. Bring the heat, Ricky. Oh, get away from me. God damn it. Why do the offensive linemen never block those guys? They just let them go. There's two guys there, and they just run right by him. You would think they would see that dude and just fucking hit him right away, right? No. No. They just let him run straight by you. Fuck it. We're just going to run. Got half of it back. I was looking at square and circle, but that angle of the camera, I couldn't tell how the coverage was looking, so we'll just uh, take our yards. Don't throw a pick in the red zone, our own red zone. Square is going to be wide open. Hang on to the ball, bitch. There you go. That's the same guy that dropped it last time. <laughs> I give my wife shit all the time because she has her own cuss words. She's like ruckum schmuckum and something else. And I'm like, that's a 15 letter word, woman. That's, that's a cuss word. You just said motherfucker. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. And all my kids just die laughing. Don't be making up your own fucking cuss words. Just say the F-bomb. The only time she'll say fuck is if she's really pissed off at me and I push that button one too many times. And I usually do that on purpose just to provoke. Because she's a little thing. She's 5'1", a buck 15, man. And that's after three kids. But I, I do that shit on purpose. I, I'm provoking a response. I told her. I don't know how many times I got to tell her. Sometimes I say shit just to see what the answer, what the reply is going to be. Doesn't mean I mean it. Doesn't mean I'm trying to be a dick. But I, I'm, I'm testing you to see how you're going to respond. <clears throat> God, that was four yards. It didn't feel like four yards. Did that look like four yards to you? Hey, we, we've only given up three points, guys. The only bad thing is we've scored nothing. Here comes the heat off the edge. Cut this shit back. Up the middle, fall forward, just short. I hate trying to run when they got that outside hanger on there. On the, when I'm trying to run the uh, counter, and that guy's sitting on the outside. All right. Somebody hold a block long enough to get the first down. Thank you. See how fast that, that corner, linebacker, safety, whatever that dude is, comes rushing off the edge? Haven't called this play all day. Let's call it. Nope. Why am I in the middle of my playbook instead of at the beginning of my playbook? I want this one right there. Circle square. No safety help. This is going to be a square if this safety doesn't come in. And they can't block long enough for me to find the guy open downfield. Wow. <clears throat> I'm 
Oh, wow. He went through my guy to get that pick. He went through my guy. Wow. Let's look at this bullshit. See that glitch? He's here, and then he's there. Wow. 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 <laughs> okay. Hey. He came from right field and went right through my guy. Keep him in there. Keep him in there. There we go. Good coverage sack. We contained him. Kept that tackle occupied till he ran into us. There it is. Dude, we got three sacks in this game. Yeah, we're not going to bite on the uh, play action. <laughs> but we can't cover. I swear to God, we win a natty this year, I'm gone for sure. Don't fucking care. We are gone. Man, I'm so hungry. Hold on. My wife got, some, got me some new deluxe mixed salt, mixed nuts sea salt. Five guys to tackle him. Five. That makes it third and three. Lay there and bleed, motherfucker. <laughs> the defender just runs right around him. There's an extra ten yards right there. Somebody, please come play defense. Imagine if Brusso played defense and I played offense. Or hell, revamp, you play defense because you're great at defense too. But you're also really good at offense. <clears throat> Six guys to tackle him. Six. Are you kidding me? We're going deep as soon as I get the ball. Got him. It's a fumble. Go down. There we go. That's four sacks this half. <clears throat> that was a missile. <sighs> Somebody else just went. MJ Melendez just went. I ran myself out of bounds trying to get away from that dude. That's okay. We don't want to give him the ball back before half. <clears throat> Six yards. That'll bring up 
second and three. Oh, I know what play. I know exactly what play I want to run. <clears throat> this looks like the uh, two I love to run, but it's not. Floated that ball. If he throws that hard, that's a uh, that's a touchdown. Hey, Mike, twenty, Mike, twenty. Quad, quad, reach out. Two, two, two. Use the wide side of the field to your advantage. Dude only has 87 speed. Who else just went? Ah, oh, the second baseman I was looking at. So everybody's just watching ADP and drafting off of that. Man blitz, huh? That's good. That's fine. That'll burn time. I wanted the touchdown, but that's okay. <laughs> We're going to uh, put chew clock on because I want to burn some time here. And I will, I will purposefully not run this into the end zone to burn more time off the clock. There we go. Want more time off this clock. Go touchdown. All right, <clears throat> they're watching my stream. <laughs> I doubt any of them know I even stream. All these guys uh, in the league, I would say out of 12, at least 8 to 10 of them I used to work with at the uh, Fantasy Sports Company. One of them used to own the, be one of the three owners of the company. <clears throat> when uh, they had an opening and they asked me to be in there, I told them I was in the league. It's like, ah, shit, this league just got even harder. <laughs> I was like, fuck yeah, dude. We're not going to give away shit this time. Look at this crap. Fucking 30 yard run. And there goes Stanton, <laughs> as I said. So, everybody we talked about, Jimmy, everybody we talked about Marte, Darvish, Abreu, Buxton. Melendez, Jimenez, and Stanton all went in that order. All of those guys went. Oh, my God. 
He went out of bounds and didn't score. They wasted that whole drive. Call timeout and have a shot at it. No. They throw that and the guy runs out of bounds and the half is over. <laughs> uh, that's why you guys have two wins. All right, who's the next guy? Salvador Perez. We mentioned him. Everybody's going. All right. That was terrible. Terrible time management. We're heading all the way outside if we can get out there. Oh. And we went outside that way instead of that way. <clears throat> We're going to try and get this dude a Heisman. He's a senior. <laughs> wow, now everybody's making their fucking picks. And the next one was Timmy Anderson. Shit, but the way these guys are rate, these guys are making picks, we'll be back to my pick tonight. And there's a hit stick. It's just not fast enough to run that. Circle, circle, circle. Nope. Don't fumble, thank you. Saw press, but he was he was on him like glue the entire way down. So I was like, all right. We'll just run out here and see if somebody else opens up. Take what we can get. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. 70 pushed the guy right into my run lane and then wouldn't clear so I could run. Cover four, R1. Just let him run all the way across the entire field, man. Pushed too hard to the outside, and he did a little jerk move, and I was trying to cut back inside that block. <clears throat> Man, I thought he was going to wiggle his way all the way in. Mr. Robinson, keep hammering those touchdowns. Get him his natty, or natty. Get him his, well, get him a natty, yeah, but get him his uh, Heisman. 
All right, took three minutes off the clock. Let's go, Mizzou. Yeah, Jimmy and Revamp and Spect, if you didn't hear me before, I got to go. In another week or so, I got to go get some uh, neurological tests done to see if I have neuropathy in my feet, my lower legs, my my uh, right ankle that got reconstructed. I have some serious pressure on top, all the way up into my toes. Um, the ankle's fine, but this nerve pain is fucking driving me insane, making it very difficult to ref. I'm sitting here and it's it's pissed, it's killing me. So uh, we're uh, having to go check to see exactly what the problem is, so they can uh, prescribe the right fix for that. Yeah. They're trying to see if it's a nerve that's being compressed or if it's something else because they can fix it with medicine. They can fix it with PT, change my diet, do this stuff. And it wasn't bothering me until about October, November. So everything was getting getting better. Tackle him. He just ran right by him. Dude's running right with him. Tackle him. Um. I was in a lot of pain refing that big ass tournament. Um, so I have two more of those tournaments coming up, and I'm not sure I can do three days like that. Which sucks because those are thousand dollar weekends, man. But it's not worth it if uh, I'm in that much pain. And like the day after I'm done, um, you would think it would hurt that fourth day, but it doesn't. It's not the fourth day. It's it's like two or three days after I get done refing that it really starts bothering me. So I've been actually looking for a new job, full-time job, where I'm not going to have to stand on a fucking referee stand for 14 hours. <clears throat> Four, five, took five motherfuckers to bring him down. Five. One, two, three, four, five. What was that? That's intentional grounding. Don't you call me for... They're calling offensive pass interference. Defense! Whoa, 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 whoa. They call that defensive pass interference. That's a backwards pass. How is that defensive pass interference? That's a fucking lateral. That's not a pass. Wow. Every day we see something new with this fucking game. Every fucking day there's some new bullshit. It was a backwards pass, yet that's a defensive pass interference.
Got you, bitch. Dive at their legs. They can't stiff arm you. Hit their fucking lower legs right like this. They can't stiff arm. Boom. Did you see him bring his hand up? Did you see that? He brought his hand up to stiff arm, and I, I dove under it. There's the stiff arm. Not today, bitch. <laughs> Can't stiff arm me if I'm underneath you. Unbelievable. Oh, I know you guys love Rage Vaughn, but I just want to play a game and not have it do bullshit. Pick it! There we go. That's the guy they call the interference on. Here's number one. Number one says, fuck you. Nice pancake. Did you see that block? Took his legs right the fuck out. Just for you, revamp. Just for you, man. Didn't have the speed. <laughs> hey, I get tired of being Rage Vaughn all the time, man. I just want to enjoy playing the game. Jimmy and Danny Snossages both love it when I rage, but I, I get tired of fucking raging. My wife gets tired of listening to me rage, too. Get in there. There we go. It's a good thing I have self-control or I would be on my 6th or 7th controller this season alone. Did you like that cut? Yeah. I told you I can play fucking offense. Defense? Defense is a different story. Mostly because I don't give a shit. I'm sure I would be really good at playing defense if I cared. But this game is skewed against the offense from the way it's programmed. I just don't have the patience. I'd rather just say, hmm, let's beat you 63 to 49 instead, right? Doesn't work when you play users, though. <laughs> Does not work when you play users. Users are like, nope, we'll take that pick and we'll take this pick and we'll take that pick. Rivalry game. Let's try this defense. We're just experimenting because nothing works. So let's see if this works. Crushed him. <clears throat> see his legs buckle when I hit him? He still has 72 yards. <laughs> it's not like it's not like we've shut these guys down at all. Where's the screen pass coming from? Gotcha. Took the second guy to bring him down. <laughs> yeah, we're going punt block. Let's keep all these baby backs back here so we can get a decent return. Yep. Man, I haven't put 100 on anybody in a long time. Look at that tackle. When we beat Texas State with Texas Tech, uh, 107 to 7 or some shit that was, I still remember Jimmy in the fourth quarter. Don't fuck this up. <laughs> I'm not going to fuck it up. Don't worry. Right, we 
have not called this play all day. Is three going to get open or not? No, there he is. Almost messed up the throw. Jim picks 1001. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate that. Welcome in. Yep, it is revamped on PS3. So if you're looking for a PC, I can't help you out. But it's uh it's on PS3. I can't be up already. Yeah. Hey Jimmy, if there's if there's not a player, an outfielder or another position player that I really, really like. And there's a stud closer sitting out there like Rysel Glacius. I'm just gonna take him. We'll just we'll just have two really good closers. Pick that! Ah, we'll have two really good closers. And then we won't really won't need another one the rest of the year. Like last year I had Liam Hendricks and Presley. <clears throat> Safety tried to tackle the tight end and he got gave himself a concussion. We're winning twenty eight to six. It was six to nothing at one point, and our crowd is dead silent. Got him. Yes, Dustin had no chance. Giving the fucking handoff to a tight end. I'm not shocked they're going for it. They're down three scores. They're all like Cameron and Doria. Yeah. They're not used to being outside for games like this. And he's going to go to the house. It's the story of my season. I cannot stop the fucking run. No one can shed a block and no one can tackle. Oh my gosh. Draw. At this point, I don't even care if they score. Just give me the ball so I can eat the rest of this clock. <clears throat> Should have pitched it. That would have been a touchdown. <laughs> How many times do we have to hit the quarterback before he goes down or fumbles? Come on, Mizzou, hold on. We need Tennessee to lose. And I don't like using the onside kick defense. Wow, we actually picked that up. It should be a penalty. They touched that ball before it got 10 yards. There you go. That's what I thought. Still first down. They tried. But we're going to hoe him back. Same fucking play we just scored on. Stay on your feet. Why would you jump? <sighs> it got us over 250, so that takes care of that.
<clears throat> With a 88 or higher speed quarterback, this is an excellent read option. Excellent read option. But you need that end to be crashing down. <clears throat> Kid Robinson is 100 yards and hopefully another one. And a touchdown. God, if this guy had speed, if he just had speed. All right, we got five on four right up the middle. Hold your blocks. Of course they don't. It's all right, that'll chew time off the clock. <laughs> and the wrong guy ran it in. Ricky Bobby Terry vultures a touchdown. All right, so we need the ball back so I can get a touchdown for Robinson. All right, three score lead, 203 left. I don't think even I can fuck this up, so. They're going to march down the field and score and not use any timeouts. You watch. They're going to go all the way down the field. In about five plays. First play is going to be about a 50-yard run. Because no one can tackle. Mm, I was hoping 43 would break off and come back and pick that off. <clears throat> That's two plays. No timeouts. Two plays. Three plays. No timeouts. Four plays. All right, they need to score on this play. Oh, one play short. Refresh your stream, guys. It's lagging. And we had it sniffed out, so they do their false start, so they get to reset their play. <laughs> Good old EA. Cheating fucking game. <clears throat> there it is. No timeouts used. Not a single timeout used. Yeah. 
Now, in this situation like that, I've actually been hit stick by the CPU and fumbled the ball, and they recovered it on the onside. So just because you recover it doesn't mean you're going to keep it. <clears throat> there goes one timeout. Fuck, refresh your stream. It's an entire play behind. I'm going to close my window with FG and see if that's causing the problem. Don't fucking crash now. Refresh again, guys. It's still about a play behind. And that gets him over 100. We still want a touchdown here. We are not kneeling out this clock. Why are you playing cover four when I'm going to run the ball? I don't get that. I'm going to call timeout so everybody's well rested. Yeah, I guess so. I'm calling timeouts here to make sure everybody's rested. I want this touchdown for Robinson. I don't want, I don't want it subbing in the other guy. So... We're going to use all these timeouts to make sure Robinson puts this in the end zone. There it is. 42-21. All right, we're three wins away. Three wins away from the uh, ACC championship game. We need a lot of help to get up the top 10. There's only one undefeated team, so we're going to need a lot of luck. We need other teams to lose. Like That's why we need Mizzou to beat Tennessee. <clears throat> Eight seconds. It's probably two plays knowing the CPU. So let's bring some heat, because if they score, it really doesn't matter. Pierre with the pick. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Dive. Oh, he didn't score. Oh, he didn't score. But guess what that means? Guess what that means? Let's go, Robinson. Push this shit in. 
<laughs> I wanted to pick six pimps, but I'll take that. That's his 25th rushing touchdown. I put that score down a little too early. It's going to be 49-21. Oh, I dove. I was trying to dive into the end zone because I saw the quarterback had the angle on me. And he uh, knocked me down with the one. That's okay. <clears throat> I'd rather get the uh, touchdown to the halfback anyway. He's going to have shit. By the time I get done with him, he might have 40 uh, rushing touchdowns this year. All right, we got to advance the week, check out our recruits, and uh, head out the door. So, to see who's out here that we can go raid once we're done doing all that shit. FG is still playing. Crazy Puerto Ricans playing Madden 23. I don't know if there's anybody else out there that you guys know that you want to go raid, but uh, we got a little bit of housekeeping to do here, and then we'll we'll be done for the day. 17 of 22, 276, one touchdown, one pick, one sack. Another 119 yards, four more touchdowns. Look at Jones, 148 and a touchdown. Hey, thank you, Random. Yeah, we were down six to nothing at one point. Outscored them 49 to 15. So just had to get our shit going. <clears throat> It always works better when you get the run game going and then throw off of that. So, Michigan beat Penn State. All right. We have Pitt at home. Then we go to Georgia Tech and go to North Carolina. So, <coughs> that's how we're going to finish up the season. That'll either be tomorrow day or tomorrow night, provided. Nothing comes up between now and then. Um, so we'll see. Since NWO's on uh, hold right now because of the PSN update and the hen issue, we might do tomorrow night. We'll see. I don't like streaming against um, FG because I like to watch his streams and streaming at the same time really uh, isn't uh, desirable. <clears throat> Let's see what he's doing. Dude's at five hours. Streaming like me. We got the last good wide receiver. So we just need a D tackle and a corner. Uh, we have extra guys. I don't want to play this game yet. Uh, we have extra guys on the board that we're pushing for. <clears throat> this guy has uh, 96 speed halfback. Need this D tackle, this corner, this corner. If we only get one, that's okay. And we just added this guy to the board. Now everybody wants to get in on it. All right, what was this? This wide receiver has 93 speed, 93 excel, 90 stamina, 85 route running, 77 catching. There's our quarterback, Philip Morris, playing Duke. <laughs> Cracks me up. And that's a computer guy, that's not me. All right, we're up to number 13. 
I think we're going to be just short unless we get a lot of upsets. <clears throat> Notre Dame's still in there. Army. Georgia. All right, root for Rutgers. Root for Cincinnati. Root for Purdue. Root for Notre Dame. Come on, TCU. Mizzou did beat Tennessee. So, we're, we're going to be short. That fucking loss to Auburn's going to kill us. If we were a four-star, we'd be up here by now. So, probably not going to get to the natty. Yeah. But, can we get us a Heisman? Yes. Adam Robinson, senior power back from Panama City. <clears throat> well, he needs 125 yards. See if we can get that done against Pitt. He's got 50 touchdowns in the last two years. Look at this. He's got 3,400 yards rushing. He only has four carries of more than 20 yards. He's a true power back. <sighs> and our quarterback is number one in pass yards. 22 touchdowns, 10 picks. That's all on me. 12 sacks. Jones is the only shot at getting a thousand because we spread this ball around a lot. <clears throat> Ten pancakes, that's nothing. Fourteen TFLs, you can tell the game just does not want us to get TFLs. They won't let us tackle anybody in the backfield. All right, let's save this. And uh, we'll call it a day and go raid somebody else. <clears throat> He is still streaming. I want to see how close he is to being done. I know some of you guys are already in his stream. Let me turn off the sound here so I can play my music. All right. And we're done. We're going to go raid FG. I know some of you guys are in there already, so that'll be easy for you. Anyway, thank you guys. Appreciate you uh, coming in and hanging out. KD, thank you for the raid, man. Appreciate you. And uh, we'll be back tomorrow, either day or night, but we'll be back tomorrow. So we'll get this raid going. And I'm going to give you the uh, thanks for watching, and I will uh, see you guys hopefully tomorrow, man. So you guys take care, and I'll uh, we'll see you down the road, man. Mm -hmm.